Playing MMORPGs is all about personalizing your experience from the way you look to the way you play. And these games are the best in the business. Hey G Nation, I'm Ben and today on Android GameSpot, the top 10 MMORPGs on Android with the best character customization. So without any further ado, let's do this. Number 10, Alliance X Empire. It's only logical in Alliance X Empire that you would start by picking a side. The Galanos Alliance has the Archer, Titan and Blade Master classes while the Holy Darken Empire features the Valkyrie, Warrior and Mage classes. Once your choice is made, you can check out an animation as well as some stats and info for each class and try on some outfits. Classes are sadly gender locked here. Next comes the customization part and the game is light in this area compared to other games in this list. You have a few face and hair options along with the option to pick your skin and eye color and 4 options of hair color and that's pretty much it. And off you go on your adventures taking on quests and slashing through waves of enemies. Number 9, A3 Still Alive. A3 Still Alive is the latest MMORPG to come out in this list and for starters, 6 class options with a short animation for each along with a description and some stats. Classes are gender locked here. This is followed by the customization menu with 15 presets to pick from as well as a randomized button. 3 face shapes available with a lot of color options and we can't forget the skin shine slider. No expensive cream required, just the slide of a button and it works! The most in-depth customizations in A3 have to do with the facial features. You can tweak and adjust the eyebrows, nose or chin to your likings while the hairstyles are limited with 6 options and all the colors you can think of. Finally, it's time to pick one from the 7 outfits available and you're ready to roll. It's worth mentioning that A3 is heavy on the autoplay features. Number 8. Talion Talion was developed by Gameville, the makers of the Xenonia series and shout out if you were a fan. At the very beginning you'll be asked to pick an alliance, the choices are the Aggies or the Biden and they are your standard light and dark forces. The next screen will have you pick one from four classes which are gender locked sadly. The customizable options include hairstyles, body shapes and skin tone and things like hair and eye color. The advanced options feature sliders to adjust some facial features like eyebrow position, length and thickness or eye size and the inner and outer corner. The same goes for other facial and body features. Of course if digging deep into customizing your character isn't your thing, the game offers some presets so you can quickly start playing. The visuals in Talion are beautiful, but note that this is a game packed with automated features from auto battle to auto complete quests or auto equip. You name it, it will auto do it. Number 7. V4 V4 starts you off with a simplistic and elegant class selection menu. 9 classes are in store and these are gender locked. A short animation with a description gives you an idea of each class and once you're satisfied, you'll be taken to an appearance presets menu with 6 looks and 5 gear styles to choose from. Next is the detailed appearance settings with only 2 face types, seems rather limited but alright. 9 hairstyles, a bunch of color options for skin, eyes and lips and there are sliders to adjust all the facial features and the upper and lower body. V4 is one of the most recent releases on mobile and features some impressive graphics and the game is cross-platform with the PC version. Number 6. Sword Art Online Integral Factor there are so many Sword Art Online games on mobile but Integral Factor is by far my favorite of the bunch as it is the only one that lets you make your own character and take on the world of Sword Art with a mix of classic RPG elements and multiplayer. You can pick a gender as well as your desired voice from options for each. The standard hair and facial hair are also here and an option to select your preferred facial expression is available. Last but not least, you'll be able to choose your skin color and add a face paint or a scar if you like. Also customizable if you're wondering and that's it. You're ready for the adventure. The game has both auto and manual gameplay and there are plenty of PvP, PvE and guild quests to take on. Number 5. Alchemia Story Coming from the team that brought us Torum Online, Akimia Story is the latest MMORPG by Azobimo and the game has a colorful and well designed world plus it's fun to play. As you launch the game you will pick your gender and good news there is no gender lock here and next you will pick your exterior base meaning the body. You have 3 options to pick from but you can always randomize them. I think having a list with all available options would have been better here but that's just my opinion. 
Next you can select easy or detailed mode of customization. I went with detailed but I'm guessing easy will have fewer options. Selecting your avatar's age will adjust your height and weight as in younger makes you shorter and lighter and older you grow taller and weight more. Only one of these is true in real life and I'll let you guess which one. You can also manually adjust the height and weight followed by some face and hairstyle selection and color adjusting. It's worth noting that the tutorial in this game takes a while before you're finally able to play but it's definitely worth it. Number 4 Adventure Quest 3D Adventure Quest 3D is one of my favorite MMORPGs on mobile and the reason why is just how easy it is to set up a party and while it doesn't have the most in-depth character creation system out there, it's still pretty decent. You can choose from 4 starting classes which are Mage, Warrior, Rogue and Healer with more classes to unlock later in the game. And it's also worth mentioning that you're free to switch classes after you pick one and no classes are gender locked. The character creation screen lets you choose from different types of hair and facial hair as well as skin color and whatnot. And while it would have been nice to be able to pick some clothes or armor here, that's not an option. But you will be equipping new gear as you come across it from loot chests or by defeating enemies. Number 3 Dragon Raja If you're looking for some eye candy, Dragon Raja got your fix. The MMORPG by Tencent has one of the most gorgeous 3D worlds on mobile and the character design is top notch as well. First you will get to pick one from the 8 classes available, there is a nice animation that showcases each class and some stats on the side. Gender wise each class comes with a male, female and girl but why they only have child in one gender and why have it at all in the first place, no idea. It's weird but moving on. Once your selection is made you can preview your avatar with 4 presets or dive into deeper customization and the game doesn't play around when it comes to that. You can customize everything from the pupils of your eyes to the height of the lip corner and when done, you can enjoy your character in one of the most gorgeous MMORPGs on mobile. Number 2 Black Desert Mobile Another heavy contender when it comes to most impressive MMORPG category on mobile, Black Desert Mobile starts by giving more classes to pick from than you can count on both hands. Next comes a highly comprehensive character customization menu. First you can check out the ready made preset avatars on the left and also try out the available outfits. And once you've made your picks comes the last section with 6 icons on the left allowing you to do some advanced customization from standards like face style and skin color to the most in depth ones like customizing the pupil, iris and lens of the eye or adjusting the curl pattern and frequency of your hairstyle. Every single part of your character is customizable and I gotta say that's pretty damn impressive. Number 1 RuneScape Having a lot of options to create and customize your character only for the game to suck once you get playing is pointless but thankfully RuneScape Mobile is far from that. You will first get to pick a gender for your hero before choosing your hairstyle, top and bottom gear along with boots and finally the facial hair if you want any. All come with plenty of options and color to really make your hero stand out and the good stuff doesn't stop there as the game is a lot of fun to play and is packed with a ton of quests and side activities that I've really never felt like I ran out of answers to the question that comes back all the time while playing MMOs, what is next? Add to that that the game looks pretty and can run on most mobile phones and tablets, one of the biggest and friendliest community in a genre and you got yourself a top classic MMORPG experience on mobile that is just oozing fun and adventure all over. And that sums up my picks for the top 10 MMORPGs with the best character customization and now I wanna hear from you in the comments. Do you spend time customizing your character or just skip it and get down to business? Of course as always if you enjoyed this video clicking the like button does help me out a lot and I would really appreciate that and if you're new consider subscribing because I put out new videos like this every week. Also special thanks to my Patreon supporters and YouTube members and link down below if you wanna support me. Once again I'm Ben, thank you AG nation for watching and I'll see you next time right here on Android GameSpot. Stay epic!